Excellency. Your Excellency. Our dear Governor. Please mind is just a remark. Your Excellency, our dear Governor, and my dear brother, Professor Charles Saludo. Your Excellency and our own dear mother. We have spoken so well that all we can do today is to go back and reflect on that your wonderful speech. And I thank my dear elder brother for inviting you. Mine is a simple remark which will not take more than two, three minutes. And it's to thank you most sincerely for the honor of coming to Nigeria for this wonderful lecture. Excellency, Excellency, my contribution, my little contribution to your speech is that the problem of Africa, problem of Nigeria, rests purely on leadership. It is bad leadership that is the problem of Africa. It has nothing to do with colonialism. We are colonized years ago. Today, it is African leaders that have turned Africa into a giant criminal enterprise. And I'll give you an example. Let me use this university. Let me use this university to give you an example of the problem we face in our country. This university, if you're employed here, you work hard for several years to be a professor. And if you're a professor in this university, your salary is 400000 naira. And if they pay you without spending your money for 30 years, your salary will amount to 144 million, which is not up to what we used to buy a car for a legislator in Nigeria. That is the problem of Nigeria. That is the problem of Nigeria. That is number one. Number two, this university where you are, this university where you are, the overhead they give to the vice chancellor from federal government of Nigeria is about 10 million naira. So in one year, they will get about 120 million naira. They have, they have five, over 500 professors, over 4,000 lecturers, over 40,000 students. They get 10 million naira, 120 million naira MBA. So five of the universities like this will get about 600 million naira annually, which if you convert to dollar today, is about 500,000 naira. That is what we use to go to a meeting of the United Nations for one week. It's unacceptable. That is the problem of Nigeria. That is the problem of Africa. We can afford to do that with less than 10 percent. So it's squarely on our distance. So I thank you for being part of this crusade. I'm sure our governor, every other person, we are part of this crusade. We must dismantle this criminality. That is the only way it can work. Thank you and God bless you. Thank you. Thank you very much, yes.